Hello my friends, so today we're going to do a little bit of stretches for the shoulders if you have shoulders very very tight. So the belt is very useful. So we're going to take belt very wide between the hands like that, very wide so wide so when you take your arms behind almost no effort. So this is just a gentle stretch. Let's stretch this way. Lengthen as you inhale, exhale, bring your arms back. And we do that a few times. This is like a little, little warm-up, gentle warm-up, before moving into the strong stretches. And if you want to stop here somewhere between and keep lengthening, stretch, stretch. Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen. And then bring your arms down. Okay, relax your shoulders. So let's bring hands now a little closer. So measure the space between your hands about two hips width. And then stretch again. Inhale. Now we're not going to take arms far behind. Lengthen and just taking the shoulders back, the belt back gently. Lift your chin and move back of the head back. So you just want to keep that length. Stretch the stretch. And then come back. Come back to the middle. Okay, relax your arms. Relax. Relax your shoulders. And we we'll repeat once more. If this was quite easy for you. So bring your hands now closer, hips width apart, but make sure that you don't work over pain. So just quickly remind you, we don't work over pain, be comfortable, maybe uncomfortable, but not in pain. So let's do another stretch. Inhale, lengthen, 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 squeeze your shoulders at the back, and moving your arms back, shoulders back, lift your chin again, and move back of the head back. Stretch the stretch. You make sure that your lower back is happy, you lengthen the tailbone, engage your tummy muscles and stretch upwards. And slightly back, don't need to go far. And then come back, exhale, come back to the middle and relax your shoulders, soften, loosen up. Okay, roll your shoulders. Well done. So now we're going to move in different direction. Move the belt to the side, no need that belt later. And then come to the wall. So I call this Titanic. So, so we're going to bring one hand on the wall, come closer to the wall. So, and what you have options here, either you have finger pads on the wall, or if you're quite open on your shoulder and you can do this, karate chop to the wall, do that. So let's try, you can try both ways. So let's try this one, finger pads on the wall. Inhale, lengthen, take your shoulders back, open your arms. Now lift your chin and move back of the head back. Neck is long and soft. Now I want you to press finger pads into the wall. Press, press, press. And you already have a lovely stretch on the front of the chest. Okay, enjoy the stretch. And maybe on one spot, just turn. Turn away from the wall. If you have that space, but don't worry, you don't have to turn. You probably already have great stretch here. Shoulder blades, back. Lift the back of the heart. Relax your neck. Enjoy the stretch. And then come back. Exhale, come back. Okay, roll the shoulders. Roll, 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 relax. Move your head, relax your neck. We change hands. And then we come back to this side again. So, change inside now. Left hand to the wall. Inhale and lengthen. Open your shoulders. Open your arm. Engage your core muscles. And press the finger pads into the wall. And again, turn on one spot. Okay, turn and turn, enjoy the stretch. I know that it's quite strong stretch. Lovely stretch here, from the sternum to your shoulder. So stretching those pectoral muscles. Lift your chest, relax your neck. Breathe deeply. Let's take another deep breath here. Great, and then come back. And again, draw the shoulders, relax, relax, relax. Okay, coming back again to the right side. This time, if you want to do karate chop to the wall, try that. Or again, keep just the finger pads on the wall. So choice, finger pads or karate chop to the wall. Maybe you can open your shoulders a little more, but don't worry to do everything. Opening the other arm, deep breath. Lift your chin, move back of the head back. 
And for me, this is just enough. I'm pressing my hand, the side of the hand into the wall, and I already have a great stretch. And maybe you need a little bit more, then you turn on one spot. you on one spot and open. Breathe. Breathe deeply. Open your chest. If this is too much, go again with the finger pads. Elbow bent and your hand is lower than the shoulder. If you look at your hand, just check. Hand is lower than the shoulder, elbow bent. And you have lots of space. Breathe. Lovely stretch. And then come back. Exhale, come back. Roll your shoulders, soften, soften, soften. Okay, coming back to the left side. Okay, again, finger pads. Or karate chop to the wall. So whatever is suitable for you. But try both. Try both and see which is suitable. Inhale, lengthen through the sides. Take your shoulders back. Relax your neck. Tummy muscles engaged. Open. And maybe this is just enough. Breathe. This is a great stretch. Relax your neck. Or oh, maybe just a finger pad. So you can try both. Try both of them and see how you go. Another deep breath. And even turn. And then come back. Exhale, come back. And again, roll your shoulders. Roll, roll, roll. Relax, relax, relax. And just shake your arms as well. Relax, relax. Roll your shoulders. So, take a belt now. And we do another shoulder stretch. So, this is where the belt is very useful. Especially if you can't reach your hands behind. Or you can take it easy with the belt and then slowly, slowly reach to your hands. Looks like that. Belt goes like that on top of the shoulder. And then you stretch your arms and see if you can do this holding the belt. Or maybe you can hold your hands behind like so. Okay, let's do it together. Belt goes on top of your right shoulder. Right arm up and your left to the side. Stretch. And then let's do that. Let's check. Can you reach your hands? If not, grab the belt behind. Hold it. Okay, maybe take it easy to start with. Okay, holding the belt. Pull your right arm forward. Draw your arm back into your shoulder joint. Now keep your arm on there snugly in your shoulder joint and then stretch your elbow up. Okay, I think I can hold my hands. So do the same if you can. This right arm keeps moving back, squeeze your shoulder blades at the back, relax your neck and keep lengthening upwards. Deep breath. Breath is always here to support you in your practice. Breathe deeply. Take another deep breath. And then relax. Relax your arms. Shake, 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 roll your shoulders and move the belt to the other shoulder. Okay. Stretch your left arm up, the right to the side, lengthen. And then see if you can hold the belt or hold your hands. Or maybe take it easy with the belt first and just check how you feel. Then fold your left arm forward, draw your arm back into your shoulder joint and then stretch, stretch, stretch that elbow up. Squeeze your shoulder blades at the back. See if you can reach your hands, but don't worry, you don't have to do everything. Lengthen, lengthen, lengthen upwards, make a soft, squeeze your shoulder blades at the back. Breathe in deeply again. Can you feel that your chest is expanding as you're breathing in? Enjoy the stretch. No pain, please. Respect the existence. And then relax. Exhale, relax. Okay, let's again shake the arms and your hands and rock, roll your shoulders. Okay, brilliant. Okay, and now I want to show you another shoulder stretch and using the belt again. So belt goes at the, at the back, under your arms. On the bottom tip of the shoulder blades, then you take one end across your shoulder, another end across your shoulder, and you're going to cross at the back, like that. Okay, and then you catch one end on one side, another end on the other side. You pull the belt down 
and you notice that your shoulder blades flat on your upper back. And that brings us again into the good posture. Bring shoulder blades flat, relax your neck, chin level, move back of the head slightly back. So if your belt is short, so mine, mine is not very long, so, but you want a long belt in ideal, so you can pull the ends downwards. But with the short belt, you can do this. You can bring, you connect the belt. Bring it here in the front, connect the belt, and you have a, like a little corset. And you can stay here for a few minutes, you know, or a few breaths, you don't have to be minutes. Okay, just to remind yourself to stand straight upright. Shoulders back, shoulder blades flat on your upper back, neck is soft and relaxed. And if you feel like you want to work like that, sitting at the desk or sitting in front of the computer, in front of your phone, your iPads, so you can try that. And this will remind you to keep the shoulders back. Okay, so enjoy the stretch. It's a just basically awareness of your good posture. Okay, see you next time.